Chelsea owner Todd Bowley spotted at Stamford Bridge with WWE legend John Cena, as Tuchel insists third is a miracle. Chelsea owner Todd Bowley was seen at Stamford Bridge alongside WWE legend John Cena last night, the American is in London, checking out his new investment as they round off another busy season. Bowley was left baffled earlier this month as he saw Chelsea have a goal disallowed in their 2-2 draw with Wolves. Last night, flanked by Cena, he saw his new team share the spoils following a hard-fought 1-1 draw against Leicester. James Madison opened the scoring for the visitors after just six minutes, before Marco Alonso leveled half an hour later. The points sealed third position with a game to spare, with Tottenham three points behind and requiring an 18-goal swing. Cena, 45, may not have been happy about this having previously posed at White Hart Lane in a Tottenham shirt. Years ago the American said. Tottenham were playing the same night I had a WWE event in London, but I was able to go and see the stadium, and I was lucky enough to actually walk on the pitch. I really loved it because it was right in the heart of the city it reminded me of an old baseball stadium with its nostalgia and tradition. I got to hear about the Spurs being the working man's team, I got to meet the coach, and it was beautiful to see the bright green pitch amidst all the city concrete. Free bets and sign-up deals best new customer offers Chelsea boss Thomas Tuchel has labeled finishing third, with N'Golo Conte missing so many games as a miracle. He said. I think he is our key, key, key player, but key, key, key players need to be on the pitch. He plays only 40% of the games. So it's maybe a miracle that we arrived in third place. Because he is our Mo Salah, he is our Virgil van Dijk, he is our Kevin De Bruyne, he is simply that player. He is our Neymar, he is our Kylian Mbappé, he is the guy who makes the difference. And if you only have him 40% it's a huge problem. Given that percentage it's maybe a miracle of how consistent we produce results and puts everything into perspective. N'Golo is our key player, and he needs to be on the pitch, because I saw Liverpool without Van Dijk last season, and they struggled, heavily. And you see the difference. So N'Golo is our key player, and he needs to be on the pitch. Quizzed whether Conte's physical issues will ever be sorted, Tuchel added. I hope so. It's hard to live with, because it's important for him to be there and have the rhythm. I think he played okay, but he can play so much better. He can play so much better, but when was his last game that he started, it was weeks ago. So he constantly starts getting rhythm, then once he gets rhythm comes a little injury and he's out again. Imagine last year, he was in the last five matches of Champions League man of the match. I mean they handed him the trophy before the match, because it was clear when he played he would be man of the match. It was like this. And this guy who gets man of the match in every Champions League game, he's only here for 40-something percent of the match.